CEO and you're sitting there and you're saying, okay, is it time yet? Is it time yet? And of course, you know, every day, everybody else wants it to be time yet because they're, everyone's always anxious and your job is let's be patient. We're in it for the long run. We're in it to win this thing big. How do you make that decision? How do you go about that balancing act? The market, we're, we're barely scratching the surface of the social landscape. I mean, these changes that we're seeing now, it's still very early. Social media is going to revolutionize the way every brand connects with every member of their audience, be that prospects, be that clients, be that investors, be that analysts. And we don't even know how that's going to look like. So we are in, in, in no hurry. Uh, for us, we're not even in the first innings. I, I tell my team, you know, we're, we're probably, you know, pre-version one uh, in terms of what the world needs as a technology platform. Granted, we have, uh, we're better than the others, but we know that we've got a long way to go. So we don't feel any pressure, and that was a conscious decision with with this this company for all of us that we're in it for the long haul we've turned down multiple offers to buy the company um, and we've just stayed focused on the bigger picture which is the way the world is going to be transformed with social media and being able to define what social media management means for large global companies and as you look at that so let's talk about that a little bit you know the targets out there you know, you know, everyone knows that the marketplace will change and will lead us down that path. You know that the movement's happening. How do you keep your team focused as you're starting to grow and aim for that target and that, that position point that you know is down there in the future? Um, and, you know, it's a little bit foggy, and you know that, but, but you know you need to get there. How do, you keep, how do you keep a team focused and energized and excited about that? It's personally been an unbelievable experience. Uh, the team that we've got at Sprinkler, I think... The team is motivated by by success that's bigger than an exit. Um, like I said to you, it's truly an opportunity to define what a new medium means to the world for the next 50, 50 years. I think that's a bigger mission that's driving a lot of us here. Um, I think the motivation, it's just, we don't need to motivate them. They, they We work, we, we, I mean, there are engineers that just stay up five nights in a row. Um, because they just want to make the product or that feature perfect. I, I think we, it's just been in the choice of the folks that have come to Sprinkler. Um, and I think when you assemble the right cast and they're motivated by, by a higher purpose, um, it is much easier. 